Hi and welcome. I'm Jackie Maru and this is a short but complete all seated chair yoga class for caregivers. This class is designed to help you get centered and also to give you time and space to move and stretch your body. For today, you can grab a block if you have one and a folded blanket or two or a towel or two works as well. And you may not need them. And if you don't have them, it's no problem. You could still practice. Get comfortable in your chair to begin. So you could sit on one of your towels or blanket and place it underneath your bottom to help you find more comfort. Or if you're like me, and when you sit back in your chair, your feet dangle and hang, you can place a blanket or two underneath your feet and you can adjust it however you need to. You wanna feel stable in your chair and be able to sit as upright as you can. We'll begin with shoulder rolls. So you can start with your right shoulder and find some movement in it, anything that's comfortable and that works for your body. Throughout class today, you can customize anything that we do to make it work for your body and how you feel in the moment. Now reverse the direction that you're rolling your shoulder in so that you can feel balanced. And now you can move to your left shoulder, up, back, and slightly down. You don't wanna force anything on your joints. Just find some gentle movements. Now you can reverse the direction. So go the opposite way. Be gentle with yourself. And now you can come to center, arms by your side and rotate your wrists. Pick any direction that works. We'll go both at the same time on this one. And then you can reverse the direction that you're going in. And now take your hands, bring them to your thighs and then lean to your right, forward slightly, over to your left and then back. Keep your feet grounded on the floor or on your blanket so that you feel stable as you lean. And now we'll move in the opposite way so you can again Reverse the direction so that you feel balanced. Move at a speed, a pace that feels good to you in this moment. And then come back to your center. Bring your arms down by your sides with your palms facing forward. Close your eyes for a moment and begin to deepen your breathing. So you begin to stretch and lengthen each inhale breath. And you also lengthen each exhale breath. And keep this slow, deep breathing with you throughout class today. It will help you center your mind. Go ahead and open up your eyes. And on your next inhale, reach your arms up and over your head as much as you can comfortably. And you can widen your arms here as much as you need. Find any path that works for you. And as your exhale comes, slowly lower your arms down by your side. Inhale, reach and stretch up. It's okay if you're ahead or behind my cues. As the exhale comes, lower your arms down by your sides. A few more here. Inhale, sweep up. Take your time. Go to the pace of your own breath. Exhale, lower slowly down. Again, inhale, reach and stretch all the way up. 
Exhale, lower your arms down by your sides. Now reach and stretch your arms up again with your breath. So on the inhale, and on your exhale, take your right hand down by your side. You can hold your chair or you can let it hang in air and lean your upper body slightly over to your right. Keep your feet stable on the ground. Bottom centered in your chair as you lean so you feel stable and secure. You can look up, down, or out, whatever feels best on your neck as you stretch the left side of your body. Release and come up and try to inhale as you reach your arms up. And then as you exhale, you can take it to the other side. Take your left arm down, you can let it hang, or you can hold anything on your chair that feels good as you lean towards your left side. Make sure your head and neck feel comfortable. You can always move and adjust to find what feels best on your body today. And then release, reach both arms up, inhale your breath as you raise your arm. And then as you exhale, slowly lower your arms back down by your sides. Feet rooted down. Now as you inhale your breath, lift your heels up. And then as you exhale, lower your heels down. We'll do that a few more times. Inhale, heels up. Exhale, heels down. Inhale, heels up. Exhale, lower them down. And then one more on your own. Now lift your right knee up as much as you can and rotate your right foot at the ankle. And then go in the opposite direction. Lower your right foot down, lift your left foot up, and do the same thing on the other side as you rotate at your ankle joint. And then go in the opposite direction. And then lower your left foot down. Now lift your right foot up as high as you can go without any pain. Now you can hold underneath your knee if you want, you can hold on top of your knee, or you can hold it up with strength. Another option is to place a block underneath your right foot and rest it there to get a lift. Find what works best for you, what feels best for you in this moment. Keep your eyes fixed on one thing or you could close them and hold. Now slowly lower your right foot down and you can move into the other side. So you can place a block underneath your left foot. You can lift up as high as you can, or you can hold on to your knee, at your knee, or underneath your knee. They all work. Find your posture in this moment. Hold and breathe deeply. and then slowly release. You can move your block aside if you used it today. Now widen your feet. So you can widen your feet out. You can also turn to the side if you feel more secure on your chair. But widen your feet so that you're opening your knees wide. Sit tall, lift your chest. Now take your right elbow to your right thigh or you can take your right forearm or elbow to a block, whatever feels better to you. Reach your left arm straight up and then lean towards your right and hold here. You can look up towards the ceiling, you can look down or out, whatever feels best for you. Root down through your feet so you're pressing down a bit to the bottoms of your feet as you simultaneously lean towards your right side. Hold here and tune in to your deep breaths, in and out through your nose.
release, come back to your center and switch sides. You can take block underneath forearm or you can rest forearm on thigh. Turn your body slightly towards your right, lean towards your left, and then reach your right arm up and over. Again, you can look up or down, press down slightly through your feet so you really feel that sense of being grounded. You're strong and solid, but also soft, stretching at the same time. And try not to collapse the weight of your upper body with your forearm on the block or your elbow, but connect to your strength as you hold, best that you can. Deep breaths as you hold. Release, come out slowly, and you can move your block aside. Bring your feet back in, press down through the bottoms of your feet. Now, take your hands and bring them to your thighs or closer to your knees. Lengthen up as you inhale your breath. And as you exhale, hinge forward at your hips as much as you can without rounding the upper back too much. So try to stay long, even if you can do an inch, do what you can, close your eyes and hold here. If it feels comfortable on your body to hinge forward more, you're welcome to do that as well. Close your eyes or look at one point as you hinge forward. Keep your feet grounded. So you're pressing down slightly through the bottoms of your feet. and then release, come up slowly. Take your hands and bring them either to the sides of your chair, you can bring them to arms of chair if you have them, or the back of your chair, whatever feels good, or you can interlace your hands behind your back, okay? Find what works for your body. Now lift the center of your chest up to stretch the front of your body, in front from shoulder to shoulder. It's a very gentle back bend here. Hold and breathe deeply. And release your hands from wherever you have them. Now, Take your right leg and cross it on top of your left leg. If this doesn't work for your body, you can keep both feet on the ground and still do this posture. So find your way. Take your left hand to your right knee and your right hand behind you so you can hold on to chair or you could rest it on the bottom of your chair, wherever feels good. Sit tall, so lengthen through your spine. Turn your head towards the right for your spine twist. Sit as upright as your body allows. Connect to your abdomen. Feel some strength there as you twist. Notice what you feel in your body. Yoga can bring us out of our heads into our bodies so we can find more presence throughout our day. release. Take left leg and bring it on top of right leg or you keep both feet down, whatever feels good for you. Take right hand to left knee or thigh, left hand behind you or you can hold on to your chair in a place that feels good. Turn your head towards your left. Sit tall, as tall as your body allows as you gently twist and keep it gentle. You don't want to force anything on our spine or our bodies. 
breathe here. And then slowly release, return to your center. Sit in a way that's comfortable and feel supportive now for your body. So you can sit back all the way, or if you have a pillow or blanket or bolster, you can place it behind your back. Take a moment to find a place of comfort. And you can close your eyes here for a breathing exercise, three part breath. Take your hands and bring them to your abdomen. As you inhale, direct your breath towards your abdomen so you feel your belly inflate slightly as you inhale. And then as you exhale, you might feel it slightly draw in, but direct your breath low. Inhale, fill your abdomen like a balloon. Exhale as you draw it in. Now inhale, fill your belly. And then direct your breath to the area in between your chest and your belly button, right here in the middle. And then exhale that space in the middle, the area of your lower ribs. And then let the air go from your belly area. Inhale, fill abdomen, lower rib area. Exhale, empty lower rib area and then abdomen. Do the best you can with this. Inhale, abdomen, lower ribs. Now direct the breath into your chest so you feel it puff out a bit and then exhale, release the chest area. Now your lower rib area and your abdomen. We'll do it again together. Keep trying, inhale, abdomen, lower ribs, chest, exhale, chest, lower ribs, abdomen. Now on your own, you can bring your hands anywhere you want them. Try that in your own way and your own pace and make it fluid like a wave is going up and then down. If this is too much for you, that's okay. Focus only on your breath in your own way. Do what you can and stay with it. Now return to your natural breath cycle. Let your breath come and let it go. Observe your breath as it comes in and out. Bring your awareness to your body, your physical body. Notice how it feels in this moment. And we'll take a few moments here of silence for you to recharge in your own way.
Begin to deepen your breath now. Gently open your eyes. And thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that this class helped you feel renewed. Have a wonderful day.